So at the start, it looks as though Rene Rast has managed to hold the lead. It also looks as though Alvaro Parent might get shuffled down, but he managed to hold on around the outside to move into the lead. There was a bit of, uh, to move to second place, sorry. There was a bit of contact throughout the pack. Uh, running wide there was Andres Simerson, and then a tap sent Laurence Van Thor into the gravel trap. He got a little bit of a knock from Alain Coder, and there you see the Audi. He managed to recover. Then we had another incident, Andrea Simonson this time getting clouted from behind, and that was from Jean-Luc Bubelic, and that was the end of the Sofrev Ferrari's afternoon, unfortunately. Sebastian Loeb was watching on as the battle for first and second raged out there. We also had battles between uh, Mike Parisi and Ye Seyfarth, and in the end, Parisi had to uh, come into the pits because he had a front left puncture. Fabian Bartes showed some robust driving to move into the lead of the gentleman's trophy class. Alvaro Parent tried everything he could to try and find a way past Rene Rast, but Rast was very impressive. And then the pit stops came around. Sebastian Loeb hopped in for his first taste of FIA GT Series action. As there you can see the damage on uh, Alan Pérez's car from some of the earlier incidents. A little bit of sideways contact there. Stefan Otelli had taken over from the number uh, in the number 11 Audi from Laurence Van Thor, he had a bit of right rear puncture problems, which pitched him into a spin going into turn 10 to end what was a very, very difficult afternoon for them. Sebastian Loeb tried to get around the outside of Nicky Mayer, mount off for the lead. He couldn't quite manage to pull it off that time, but he kept pressing, he kept pressing, and eventually he would find his way past into the lead of the race. And the uh, Rene Rast there, the teammate of Mayer, mount off, watching on Loeb, had a little look to the outside again, managed to get pretty much all the way around the outside down into the hairpin at turn seven, but Mayor Manoff knew what he was doing, ran him out of road, and it didn't look as though the mistake that Loeb needed was going to come from Mayor Manoff, who was defending very robustly indeed. But towards the end of the race, Mayor Manoff either began to tire or got a little bit distracted, and then he was shown exactly how to be dummied, I think. Sebastian Loeb cutting this way and that way to try and get past. And in the end, Sebastian Loeb took the lead and won the qualification race. It was very, very impressive performance from him. Contact throughout the field, Aman Ibrahim sent spinning. But Sebastian Loeb, on his much anticipated debut here in FIA GT Series, took the checker flag. He will start on pole position for tomorrow's main race here in the FIA GT Series.